Christian Patel from way downtown. Christian Patel buries a long three. He's got five for the Huskies. And look at Patel again. There's another steal. That is his sixth of the game. Altery Gilbert halfway down. Polly, the offensive rebound. Patel. Christian Patel getting it done from everywhere on the floor. Patel. Oh, Christian Patel, very nifty. He's into double figures with 11. Easy. Christian Patel in the middle of things again. No resistance, coast to coast, Christian Patel. Polly. Boy, Patel has a knack for the basketball. Christian Patel again, all the way to the basket. He's got 15 of his 17 points here oh, in the second man. half. He's a really good slasher, but he's got it all going now. Patel finally able to knock one down for UConn. No, but he made the point that if they're, if they're a top 200 team, and maybe even beyond, like, you're probably going to get a game for in a real... For, they get fired up when Walker comes in a 20-point game and makes a deuce, let alone a game that's like 14 minutes to go on the road. Patel mm. able to parry a card at three, UConn. From 27 down, UConn has cut it to nine. Patel, got it! <laughs> Daly drives, scoops oh, it up, no. Got away with it. I thought it was. Patel, what a move, scoops it up and in. Reason Florida hasn't really gotten on track yet. Oh. Vital three, that's the bottom of the net, and Connecticut grabs the lead. And there's another steal by Tal ahead of the floor. And he flushes it. Christian Vitale scored five in a row. So is Sidney Wilson, number 15. And then they switch back man to man. Five on the shot clock. Tough shot by Tal. Oh, he's hot right now. He has scored the last seven. And getting Florida to react to them, doing a terrific job with their scouting report defense. Vitale, back drains. And Christian Vitale picking up when Holly is not making the buckets. <laughs> this is Altariq Gilbert. Eyes up. Corner for Vitale. Good. Ball on the ground. And, uh, Hartnett brought it down. That one was stripped away. Vitale scores. Dan Hurley wanted an illegal screen that free Jordan up for that shot. No whistle. And Vital answers back right in front of the Bulls bench. Vital. Four on the shot clock. Blows by his man for the score. Vital stutters. Leaves it for Whaley. And on the baseline, Vital cleans it up. Vital downhill, lays it in. Well, he made the big plays late in the Florida game. And the long rebound starts to break for Altariq Gilbert. Christian Vital got the three. Vital left wide open. Got it. game between the Huskies and the Hurricanes and Vital gets the Huskies on the board. What a big shot by Vital. It is to move the basketball up the court faster with the lower shot clock. The towel with the runner and the scoop. This match here. Gilbert to the corner wide open look for three. What a start for Christian Vital and the Huskies. All of that happened because of the change in screens. A cook. Give it back to him. Difference though, you see the double team by Miami. Good cut. You had two scratch golfers out there that just had a day off. Uh huh. Uh huh. The towel pulls up, knocks it down. 
Christian Vital, the left hand. His, his physicality and his ability to, to play all these cuts that Maine presents on the offensive end. And there's Vital doing a nice job of slicing to the rim. Vital knifing through that Iona defense and putting it in off the glass. First bucket of the game belongs to the Huskies. Tim stays on his feet and gets the rejection. And here comes Vital, the run out. And a two-hand stop by Christian Vital. As we come up on 16 minutes and 10 seconds to go here in Storrs, Connecticut, UConn. Christian Vital from way downtown, and that one rattles in, and Christian Vital red hot out of the gate. Gist, good ball movement, but Gist cannot finish it. Cook a cook with the rebound down the other way. Here comes Christian Vital, lays it in. They're not afraid of anybody. His teams over the years have played everyone tough. They, they're not afraid to go on the road and play games like tonight. Christian Vital. Lane for Vital to receive that pass. That's 13 turnovers now for UConn. Good move, Christian Vital. That's what UConn needed. He'll have a chance at a three-point play. Don't count them out. I know everybody I walk around says, oh, they're overrated. They were overrated. I'll be patient. Vital oh, rattles home a three. Vital, man. With Not by Vital. 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 The patience that he's going for. Well, most bullhead guys got to stick together. <laughs> That's right. Vital has to muscle his way in, and he does. Vital kicking back to Gilbert. Head fake. Extra pass back to Vital. Boy, great two-man basketball right there. And there's a double team and a steal. Christian Vital gliding in and finishing off the glass. Boy, Carlton making Woods work very hard. Vital all the way down the lane and lays it in. Terrific ball movement early on here for UConn. Vital down the lane, crawls over the front iron, gets it to go. He'll have a shot now at a conventional three-point play. See, that was an awful shot off his contest. Vital in rhythm. Christian Vital buries it. And Sutherland is very, very effective. 6-5, versatile. Gilbert, point blank, there's Vital. You know, he just finds ways to score the basketball. Yeah, and not a lot of coaches are like that. He wants them ready for every situation they may face. That line jumper by Christian Patel. Common foul on Shaquan Gibbs, and so UConn with possession of the basketball. There's Christian Patel. Rattles in. Christian Patel now with five points for the Huskies. He's still down. UConn has numbers back the other way. Patel from the right corner. Third block of the game for a cook, a cook, and there's a steal by Christian Vital in the open floor, gliding in, and the one-hand stuff. Gilbert and Carlton back to the UConn bench. Just great hustle and intensity by Christian Vital. Just, you cannot be loose with your dribble around him because he is aggressive, he loves it. Two minutes, 20 seconds to go here in this first half. UConn looking to go to nine and three on the season. There's Vital lining it up. Trying to get Carlton going. Vital up fake, mid-range. Christian Vital comes screaming in. Christian Vital knows how to smell points. This is how as a guard just attack the offensive glass and finish with toughness. But if he could shoot that 10-foot jumper facing up, Boy, how would that change everything for you, Kyle? That would. I'm not sure he's comfortable doing that yet, but he's keep working on his game. Stepping behind the line. Christian Vital now with five three-pointers in the game. Shot clock already under 10. Vital takes the handoff from Polly. He's open for a moment, and his jumper's good. Gets a nice central separation. Yeah, definitely. Steal the open floor by Vital, and he goes right in with a two-handed jam. Scott passes deflected. Book Knight picks it up. Good defense by UConn to get back. Stop. The towel for three. It's good. That's it by Book Knight. Gilbert trying to dish it off. He does get it to Vital. Seven to shoot. Tough little fadeaway. Nice touch by Christian Vital. Mary Chavis. Mary Chavis. The old fashioned hook. Whaley got a piece of it and gets the rebound. Whaley's earning starting position right now. 
Vital. Oh, that's a gorgeous step. And Vital into the cheerleaders. You name it. Okay. St. John's is not St. John's from the 1980s. No, absolutely not. There's a great drive by Vital. And you've got to get the ball to that high post area where Josh Carlton is. Here's Vital. Deep three is good. Mm -hmm. Better than 17 points per game. Shot clock at four. Vital deep three is good. Mm -hmm. Yeah, well. <laughs> see that? That timeout's valuable. Gilbert nearly coughed it up. Vital has it, and he scores. And so, is it not consistent offensively? Carlton finds a cutting Vital. Shot clock at five. Vital races in and scores. How do we have a beach? <laughs> Gilbert is out on the bench, and Gaffney replaces him as Whoa. Vital lays it in. There's a big possession here to get it to five, no question. Vital on the drive. That's the guy. Got a battle now all the way to the end. And Book Knight hops off the bench with those four fouls, set to check in. Vital attacking and That's lays it in. It's now or never. You might as well put him in. Vital lays it in again. He's got 16. He's got to get it done. ATN's the best on-ball defender, but he's got his hands full with Gilbert, Steve. Vital off glass wow. for two. Vital directing traffic. You got a score, call timeout, get your defense. Zoned by Wichita State. Vital deep three is good! <laughs> Vital in the lane. And knocks down the eight footer out of nowhere. Here's the towel, and he knocks down the 10 footer. Here's Bay, had it, lost it. Turnover, Gilbert pushing. How did Lane he see him? And in. How did he see him? Turns the corner, downhill, fades. Got it. It's, it's been applied. One point lead for UConn. Vital for three. Yes! Now that's the guy you do not leave. Because the way they have played here today, they have played Nova tough. They've given them everything that they wanted, and then some. Vital! Makes other players better. That's a sign of a good point guard. Gilbert, rainbow, no. Tapped out. Oh, Vital wide open. And he buries the triple. Now it's Mills. There's Vital again. A steal and the run out. To UConn, you want to get that ball in Vital or Gilbert's hands. Give them room to create. Vital over Grimes. That's money. Carlton to a cutting Vital. And he's got his first bucket of the day. They'd be nice if Christian Vital could make a shot. Vital drives in and scores on cue. He's got 28 points. Vital lays it in with the left hand. 14 seconds left. Let's go beat that. Vital with the right hand. Count it in the foul. Coach McKee wants him to be a more vocal leader and lead by example. And when, when his team isn't scoring, and one. Vital with the three. He's going to head to the free throw line. That's exactly what UConn needs tonight. You know, you can have a lead. You can play with the lead and, and get it done and close it out. Vital with another three. And showing how many great players they have. I mean, Ahead of the fray comes Book Knight. And just over three minutes gone by. It's a corner three. And Connecticut, good start. That is Vital. He can stroke it. Now we get a chance to idle it down just briefly. Well, you are a wordsmith, my friend. <laughs> For oh, trying to paint the picture. Not Knocking down a three. Not down a point. Triple drive. No. That was Tyler Harris. Never had it cleanly. At the end. Vicious two-handed stuff. Mm. Huskies get it back. Carlton tracks it down. Outside. Patel. That's a three. And so he really appreciates where he is and what he has. The towel off the offensive rebound, and he sticks it. And Gilbert with the steal. No look into the corner. This is the towel. 
Short, and they get the friendly bounce. High, doesn't demand the basketball. Right now he's hanging around the foul line. He's going to try to find a rebound. Doesn't have to worry about it as Christian Batal. Adams is left wide open. And the offensive putback by Christian Vital. James Booknight. Vital on Corita. Blew right by him tonight and beat Tulane. Will tie Cincinnati for first. At the moment, Cincinnati has first place in the conference. Guarding their best offensive player last game, Booknight, not allowing him to get easy touches. Vital, a deep three, and he switches it. Downtown. I, honestly, I think it favors Cincinnati just because they're, they're used to being in games where they win. Unfortunately, UConn is nice, nice layup there. He said, deny that shooter the ball, the cousin of Jaron. And a three ball uh, response, Christian Vital. That is a tough shot to come to play. Physical, heard the call from Coach Hurley. They're getting down and dirty. Now on the inside of his jacket. He almost looks like an NFL coordinator. <laughs> Deep he look. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Vital, though, a game high 14. He's four for four from deep. I mean, look where that is. Oh, my goodness. That's on the 84. What, 84 <laughs> East? <laughs> That's from 84 East. <laughs> wow. He's a bucket. Ugly miss, Vital! Nice offense, step back jump shot. Both teams shooting it pretty well. 35% the last handful of games after shooting only 26% overall. Nice play off the board and getting a soft bounce. Number one in blue, Christian Vital, 6'2 senior. Because the way he had been rolling, he might have been tempted to take a long turnaround jump shot. That ball deflected, comes out to Vital. And stays down. Hey, you watch Memphis, and watch how active they are defensively. Vital hits a three. Vital will take it. And knock down the three. His second three of the game. Around and out for Gaffney. Offensive rebound for one of the best rebounding guards in the country, Vital. Locked in on basketball in general and this team. Uh, he's all in. Vital with another big bucket. He's got eight in the half. They were tied at 41. It's advanced this year. They're a team. They're a veteran team invested in each other. They have a physicality, a toughness, a maturity, especially right now in college basketball. What a step back from Vital. They can swing it and attack. That's when they're at their best in the half court. Yep. Vital, what a lob, but could not connect cleanly with Wilson. Inside Vital, able to put it home, and UConn's back in front. In 15 years, and you see players older in their career, like Kobe Bryant, how he came back and was able to play. And Kevin Durant's already up shooting. He's going to be back playing. Left-handed take by Christian Vital, already with nine here in the first half. Vital with a little shot fake to get the space over Perry, and he drills it. Double figures in the first half for Christian Vital. Book Knight spinning inside, nearly finished it. Whaley did a great job on the glass. He's blocked by Rose. Vital inside, put it back up and in, and it's back down to three. Vital on the drive. Just got it to go home. Here's Vital, tough three, got it to go. And it's a two point game with 9.5 remaining. And credit Vital, you had to get a three up in that situation. The ball can provide about 13 minutes a game for the Bulls off the bench. Vital take for two, his first bucket. Guys outside the three point line and the movement is better. Vital, step back, four. That guy's a competitor, I can tell you that. Shot clock have lost three in a row. Entering play today, five to shoot. Here's Vital, here's the take. Off the glass, with a left. For David Collins today, Castaneda to take. Too hot to handle for Durham. 
Steel Patel, two on one with Adams. The lefty move, reverse layup, he hits it. UConn is doubling all exchanges of the basketball effectively. Patel drains a three. He's not playing up to par or players in foul trouble. Patel, too strong in the bottom of the corner. Whaley, good hustle. Kick out Patel, tries again from three. You bet. Steal. Patel. The steal, the explosion, that guy's little. Boy, Collins is really trying to get steals here in the last couple of minutes. Hate to shoot. Batal, three, ball, down. Who do you like, Kevin, that could have an impact on this game? Tony Johnson Jr., you mentioned, and then Darren Green Jr., Really good freshman shooter. Don't like that for UCF, though, as Vital finishes the layup, and he'll go to the line with a chance for three. Uh, Ingram does just that. UCF is happy to have him back to full health. Vital off the shot fake. He buries a three. Green, short, and the rebound to Vital. Pace is getting a little frenetic right now, and that's just fine for Christian Vital. Johnny Dawkins needs a timeout right here. UConn scored 30 points in the paint. Burt slips. Adams on the deck. Pushes it ahead to Vital. Christian Vital elevates and scores. Just to clear up the folks who don't know, you're touching on the situation. Kevin Ollie, who was let go a couple of years ago. There's a lawsuit currently pending. Local reports that Dan Hurley was served a subpoena on Saturday. The school has called that unnecessary and surprising to Coach Early, quote, who has nothing to do with this case. Don't let the defense speed you up or force you to take a bad shot, but attack the pressure. The towel for three. Much easier. Watch the baseline. He's going good. The towel two to shoot. He scores. The team rules. And for East Carolina, Tyree Jackson forced to miss his third straight game with a calf injury as the Huskies get on the board first. Whaley's been assigned in a sloppy pass. Vital colliding with Newton. He'll go one on one, try to draw the contact. He didn't get a whistle, but he got a bucket. Rebound to Book In fact, they are the worst in the American. Yeah, you might be open for a reason sometimes. Yep. Mm -hmm. But he's open, that's not good for you. No, no, that's not what you want to do. And Goes out right now, action from ECU on this possession. Now, quick fire three, wow. no problem. And he looks back over at the students to keep control of it. That's what they have to do. Patel. Wow. Man, have that kind of confidence right now. You just shoot it. Hand in your face, it doesn't matter. Shot at that time. And he's just tied the season high with his fifth made three. Adams was originally recruited by Dan Hurley to go to Rhode Island. He decided to decommit and come here to UConn with him. Shot clock is under 10. This is going up. And Vital fires. It is good. This is going up. <laughs> Yeah, think about all the threes they lost from last year. 14-0 run as Vital cuts to the hoop. And they don't have awesome this year, <laughs> but they sure do play well together. Yeah, they got pretty good, though. Yep. Crossover by Vital. Vital up off the glass. He's able to thread the needle. Speaking of awesome, how about that guy? Here's Vital for three. It's good. Grimes got caught. They went over that play in practice. Typical of UConn. Sometimes they go four guards. 
The towel heads to the hoop off the glass. Got the bounce off the rim. Mills, no low pass cut off by Vital. Here come the Huskies. Vital goes right to the rim, lays it in. So much stronger. Here's Vital, left side of the lane. His jumper is good. It's Nine senior one. night. Tom, it's senior night. <laughs> To go to the free throw line for Gilbert. Back to Book Knight. Inside for Batal. And Batal leads it off the back of the iron. He's 6'2. Al Tariq Gilbert replaced him. And then there's Batal, one of the Steel's leaders in the country, with a takeaway. Batal with a three on his first shot. Gator <laughs> in a crime <laughs> TV show with, with all your and wire trying to figure out who's what. Batal off the inbound, and that would have been good even with three to shoot. Perhaps coincidentally, perhaps not. Gilbert nearly lost it. Gaffney the extra feed, Vital. Five to shoot, and Vital carries a two over John. Yeah. They would have to win the conference tournament to get into the field. Gilbert with a beautiful feed, and Vital finishes yeah. from the floor and from the line, and he's brought Tulane back within two. Dude, that kid's a bowling ball. I mean, he is strong when he gets in the air. Vital. Bone shaking stutter step. On the deck now, Adams took it away from Lawson. Vital with a lead feed, and Vital scores in transition. Yeah, they got to start flashing into that top zone and dragging the middle away, and they've gotten away from that. And it also helps knock it down threes. Vital finally unlocks his scoring. He's got 24, has 19 on 7 of 8 shooting. He's brought Tulane within a bucket on senior night. Vital over days. He scores. In his final regular season game, Christian Vital is just four points shy of a career high. He's got at least 26 for the third straight day. And joins a very elite group of UConn Huskies. He's done that, and he's just recently passed Jalen Adams in 10th of the all-time career scoring. And well, he is inching closer and closer to number nine, Kimba Walker, and uh, he may end up number nine. He has been outstanding again here this afternoon. What do you think of this list? Kimba Walker, Shabazz Napier, Jalen Adams, that's a pretty good company to be in. Yeah, it is. Remember, the Christian Vital, we talked about this earlier, Reedy. There was thought that Christian Vital might transfer after last year. He and Dan Hurley butted heads, and the transformation of Vital over the last couple of months has been a sight to behold. Yeah, you know, and not at the beginning of the season, and that's what surprised me, that, it, that it's just been recently, and, you know, Dan Hurley said, look, we sat down and we said, let's figure out what we have in common. Let's start from there and then figure out how to make this work. And, you know, Dan Hurley, as proud as he is of the production, well, he was equally proud of the kind of leader that he's become in the locker room and in practice, and you got young freshmen like book night looking to him and it really has helped change the culture back to where it once was.